Hola, and welcome to Cooking with Skinny and Mini. I'm Chef Doug. And I'm Chuck Love. And today, Chuck, is Cinco de Mayo. Yes, I love Cinco de Mayo. Me too. I love my Mexican food. So what we're going to do today is show everybody how to make guacamole. Oh, yes. Now, Chuck, do you know how to make guacamole? <laughs> no, I do not. I know it has avocado in it. And then we also have roasted red pepper, red onion, jalapeno, and a little cilantro for taste, salt, and pepper at the end. And that's how we make our guacamole. All right, Chuck, now when we make guacamole, the main basis is an avocado, but we have to learn how to work with an avocado. Is there, is there a certain way to cut down an avocado? There is, and what you want to do, you just want to slice it around. Ready, Chuck? I'm ready. I go ahead, I cut in there. Now I can feel the seed as I work my way around the avocado. I just kind of move the avocado around the knife, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to give it a twist. It and it comes out, you see how the one side has a seed, the other side doesn't? Uh -huh. Now we're going to have to get that seed out. And what we're going to do is take the heel of our knife, bang it in, and take it out. Chuck, why don't you go ahead and show everybody how to work with an avocado. Okay. There you go, Chuck. Now Big twist. Open it up, and there's a seed. There you Last go. Side. Now we're going to get that seed out. Okay. I take the heel of it. Okay, I'm going to grab it like so. Push it in there, twist, oh, let me try one more time. Oh, there you go, I got it out. Alright Chuck, now that we know how to get the seed out, mm -hmm. we got to learn how to get the avocado out of the skin. So what I like to do is cut it in half, and then you can take your spoon, since this is nice and ripe, and you can just scoop it right on out, in one whole piece, just like that. Oh, that came out very nicely. There you go Chuck, cut your avocado in half. Okay, now I'm going to grab my spoon. Get your spoon, and you can scoop out the avocado out of the skin. Oh yeah. There you go, Chuck. Good job. There you go, and get the rest of it out. Alright, we don't want to waste any of that wonderful avocado. Alright, Chuck, now I want to teach you a little mini tip. Because the way we got this avocado is so ripe, I picked these up yesterday, even though I knew Cinco de Mayo was today, I should have got them a few days ago. So what you can do, you can put your avocados in a brown paper bag. What does that do? It actually, you seal it up overnight, it releases gases in the brown paper bag, and it ripens it overnight. It's amazing. Can you do that with other foods? You certainly can. You can do it with some bananas if you got real yeah. green bananas. You put them in a brown paper bag, seal it up, in a day or two, it'll be pretty ripe. Oh, that's great. Yeah, so nice little mini tip. All right, Chuck, now that we have our avocados scooped out of our skin, we're going to go ahead and make our world famous cooking with skinny and mini guacamole. Oh, yes, guacamole. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and scoop all my avocado into my bowl. So, Chuck, you take your fork and you're going to go ahead and just kind of mash it up. There you go, Chuck. You're mashing it all up perfectly with your fork. Looks good. Now, Chuck, you see how this is all nice and mashed? I have all the big pieces out. Yeah, I see that. You see that? Now, that's a good foundation to our guacamole here. And then all we have to do is add the rest of our ingredients. Alright Chuck, here's the fun part. We just gotta mix it up and we have our cooking with skinny and mini guacamole. See I got my roasted red pepper in there for color, my cilantro, red onion, and a little jalapeno for a little little that spice, a little boom. Yeah. A little action there. So now it's time to serve. Alright, this is cooking with skinny and mini. We're done our guacamole and now we have a walking nacho tray <laughs> with the guacamole at the top. How's it taste, Doug? Chuck, that was the greatest guacamole I ever had. Could you pass me down a chip, please? I sure will. Here you go. Ah, uh, mmm. Very good. good. So, that's cooking with skinny and mini. I'm Chef Doug. And I'm Chuck Bo. And we will have a walking nacho tray. Coming your way.